Good evening, everybody. This is David Slash Asher, and joining me is MPX. Hello. And we will not have Kage due to some changes in plans. But we will be continuing with the plan. We will be doing Bloodstained. So, let's get this party started. Oh, sh shut up, Jeff Goldblum. No one cares about you. Rather mean. Well, given the fact that it's an ad about uh, renting apartments, no. <laughs> Sorry, Jeff Goldblum, but no. So, uh, game start. We are going to do a new data. Yes, I know this is my previous times. But, yeah. No, we're not going to see that. Actually, let me jump it down a few bits of data. Put it at the bottom one. Miriam. We're gonna stay with Miriam. Miriam. Yes, I can play as other. This is a special mode intended for familiar with the story and progression. Do so before Zen gets to. Aurora. We will be doing Miriam. I haven't beat the game, obviously, because otherwise I would have heart or nightmare. So normal. And away we go. Are you muted? No, I'm not. Uh, Ed, are you hearing the side audio? No. Oh, interesting. No, that it's actually there's actually a narrator. Although the audio balancing is a little wonky. All right. <sighs> Who keeps summoning Dracula? Not yours. You, you 
We'll find out. I wish I had the answer. All I know is the spell that stopped time for you was advanced, arcane. But by observing the ebb of the magic's hold on you, I was able to predict exactly when you would wake up. Oh, I see. We'll make landfall soon. You should get ready. I have the chest there packed with essential equipment. Now would be a good time to put it on. Actually, options. Yeah, I still don't hear anything. I'm gonna change the master volume up to four. Okay. Are you hearing a creaking of a boat now? No. Oh, there I heard it. Okay. So, so you heard the like the. The confirmation sound, yes. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna... Leave it there. Put it up to six. Okay. Equipment. Defense one, scoff one. Mm. But yes, this is Castle Vanyorg's. Wait, Pong. We can either have shoes or nif. So, do we want to be stabby stab or do we want to be kick kick? Ah, your choice. Uh, well, since this is obviously a Symphony of the Night, uh, successor. I can't say it's a clone or inspired by because quite literally it's created by Koji Igarashi, aka Iga, the man behind Symph Symphony of the Night, and this extremely does show. And yes, I know I said like, but aren't you getting away from RPGs? This is an action RPG. It's not quite the same as turn-based. So. Uh, for now, let's just do knife, because stabby stab, because as we saw, it has little indicators down the bottom of like what the attack is, and I believe this one is pierce or slash, whereas this one is uh, strike. Good. You're prepared. The next order of business is to... Are you now hearing their voices? Yeah. Okay. Oh no, Squid Boy! I'll take care of it. Stab, 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 stab. Oh no! And now we get the music! Contra chart. Civilians. Was that a shard? I'd forgotten the way it felt. Like uninvited claws scraping across my bones. The demon's power was transmuted into that shard, which forcibly bonded to the crystal embedded in your body. The strength you gain from it is undeniable, but eventually, the crystal will devour you. I thought the procedure you discovered halted the corruption. It did. But that doesn't guarantee you'll be safe if you start absorbing shards in massive quantities. I know my body's limits better than anyone. That's what they all say. And I'm going to need all the power I can get. And that's what Trevor Belmont said. If I run into trouble, you can help me. You've done it before. You'll do it again. <laughs> Thanks for giving me a choice in the matter. 
Well, I won't let you down. Not if I can help it. Just promise you won't push yourself. <laughs> Not quite a Wilhelm scream, but... Oh no! How do they get inside? By the same way the rest of them did. They punched a hole in the ship, Miriam. The demons from the castle must have infested the ship. D then they can help me wake up these muscles of mine. I'll wipe the deck with them. Obviously. Time to punch. Galleon Minerva. Oh yeah. Okay, it's already set. Well, yeah, it's your first one. You'd never know, like... Device responds to magic. Maybe I just need to hold my hand up to it. Okay. Level up. Country dress. Oop. Yep. Put on the dress. It's better than nothing. Oh, good. Magic just slowly regens. That's that's actually pretty good. Drop mana rose. Ah. Nope. I need double jump. Sorry, paying attention to the uh trying to find secret secrets. <laughs> well, paying attention to the map, really. Fuck off. Uh, Ooh, that was good. Sea urchin. Rusted ring. Accessory. Rin Lusson! Castlevania. Tunic. Is that better or worse? Dress. It is worse. <laughs> you have found book! Ah, here we go. 
I was wrong, Thrust. So, welcome to tutorial. Slash, Thrust, Strike. Fire, Ice, Thunder, Light, Dark, Poison, Curse, Stone. This is the first... Yep! This is the first one that actually changes... Uh, there are pieces of equipment that do change. And I think, as a weird part, this hairband was part of uh, Miriam's original design. And then we got changed to the weird, like, horn hairband for whatever reason. There are other cosmetics in the game. Uh, it's just that uh, you're not going to be able to. Every single item is not going to be a cosmetic. Oh! Oh no! One more towards completion. So I think that was necessary because it was. Yeah, that one is. There we go. Bronze, Haylight, and Sugar. Want something more than this dagger? You know what? I'm gonna swap this knife for the kung fu shoes for a brief moment. See how they play out. I mean, I don't think you get much else out of it. Maybe you lose some reach. I think it's a tiny bit extra reach. I'm not saying that it's like super good reach. I'm saying it's like. Now have the map. I'm kicking these guys in the back of the head. <laughs> Fly. Morte. I don't think the Mort's, uh, Mortas have, uh, any abilities. Uh, I thought this was like most of them, that every single creature has something. To my knowledge, maybe, but... It's just such a low chance, yeah. so you have to kill hundreds. Also, this returns! 
but now it is weapon specific. But yes, these yeah. these things will be saved in my journal. So it's like we go to the archives. Here we go. Like uh, techniques. Oh, I guess I, I guess ha you have to perform it first. Yeah. There we go. Flashing air kick, which also has a mastery. Yep. Uh, we're gonna go back to the short sword. Wait a minute. There are a couple things that uh, have walls. Like, completely around them. Ah, yes. In the eternal fashion, you sit down. Uh, so this is a Castlevania where you can... There's... I don't think there's anything really based off of what we do. This is just kind of surprising that this is here because... How is this couch thing in a boat? <laughs> and... Okay. Tattered scarf. Uh... Are you better? You are slightly better. I wonder if we will get that uh, item. Okay, there's a chest up there, but I need double jump. It's just actually... <laughs> yeah! Eat it! Wait a minute. Yeah. Oh. Ugh. What are you? more, I think. I think we're gonna go stick with the short sword because it's quicker. Horn seed. I made a doorway. Ow. So bitch. No, you get fuck. Hey! This ship is made of plaster. 
Max MP up. Yay. Thousand G. SP rounds? Miskatoon. So, yes, you have guns in this. We're gonna be using guns, not readily. Another save point. Always save. Not, not the place I wanted to be. Here it is. Block puzzle. And we got the web. For the true. That's probably got a good range, but it's got a really weird cooldown to it, so... Back to the sword! Seriously, who doesn't explore these places? Kill the rats! We found another sofa! This ship is full of sofas. If people wondering, like, aren't you gonna be missing out on shards? Like, uh, not really. I mean, here's a secret. Uh, you can come back to the ship. Oh no, man in a mask. So sleeping beauty, you've decided to awaken. Why do I feel like I recognize this guy's voice? Probably do. Yeah, but I'm trying to remember from where. And that's the weird part. Shibu, tell me you didn't do this. It doesn't make any sense. Of course he didn't do this. It's the book that did it. Seriously, the book is glowing. How does it not? After all the sins humans wrought upon us. What is a man? Psh, a miserable pile of sure. Johannes told me what they did to you. And you're right, it's horrible. But what you're doing now is just as bad. No! No, there you are, 
very wrong. Oh! Oh, I think I recognize him now. Uh... Plays another silver-haired protagonist. Uh... Technically second fiddle to what everybody considers the same uh, main character of the series. Uh, but uh, kind of comes into his own in the standalone game of his called Revengeance. Ah. <laughs> I forget uh, the voice actor's name, but I, I heard the, the, the weird grumbly part of it. What the alchemists did was reshuffle <laughs> our bodies. I mean, if you could double check, that'd be great, but I'm pretty sure that's him. What I intend to do is reshuffle the world. I'd say I've earned the right. Join me, Miriam. You're the only one who understands the pain I feel. What it's like to no longer be human. What? I never thought I'd hear those words from you. I was the one that came to you broken, convinced I was a monster, and you told me... This is nonsense. There it is again. You told me our power doesn't make us good or bad. <coughs> our choices do. I'd given up on my humanity, but you restored my hope. Don't you remember? <sighs> uh, Master Jeebo. We must return. Grimmery! Not to be confused with Grimmery of that game series. Yes. Miriam, I tire of reminiscing with you. You're here to kill me, aren't you? Then first prove you can find me. Along the way, you'll have no choice but to absorb shards and avail yourself of the powers of hell. If you can still claim to be human at the end of it all, then perhaps I might be more inclined to listen. Come, Gremlin. We're leaving. That's a lot of hands. Debo, wait! Nope! Yes, I know it's a boss, but I mean he has voiced some silver-haired characters. Okay, I, okay. But, so uh, hmm. the person that I thought he was was not who he, I thought he was. Yep. Uh, so he has voiced silver-haired characters, but not the one I was thinking of. I'm trying to find one which you probably have heard him play as, but... Gintama? No. <laughs> Alright, boss time. Two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. So, come, Gregory. Thankfully, we can skip cutscenes.
best double checking to make sure it's not a miss. Uh, no. Somebody forgot to list something more important. No. Oh wow. I might have heard him what? Uh, well, unfortunately, this list doesn't have it. Just double check this. Didn't do better. We're gonna be seeing this a lot, by the way. <laughs> I'm not that good. Contra- it's like, I'm pretty sure if people saw our stream of, uh... Okay, I- Short Sword is not gonna do it. I feel like we're gonna need the Claymore for this one. He's listed at, actually as the narrator in uh, Amakura Fires of River. Really? Yeah.
Another level? Maybe. Like, how close are you to one? Okay. Dead. 70. So... Oh good, he arrived in land. We got the big boy shard! Head flail. Back wall.
Tentacle. I saw it. Just a flicker. That was the Jebel I know. I will put a stop to all this. Intro scene. Blood stain. That is actually David Hayter, I'm pretty sure. People summoned? They've moved faster than we hoped. Miriam, we have to hurry. This was where we were supposed to meet our contact. All right. But wait. Let me clear the area. There are still demons about. The Pars Tentacles. That's a lot of MP. I think I'll stick with Head Flail for now. Promise you'll be careful. Just hope that she's still safe. Arvant uh, Arvantville. Vampires, because we got oh, we got the student mask. We're putting it on because it's actually pretty good equipment. I did not know we got this helmet. Leave that alone for now. I guess I picked it up when we beat one of the Dullahans. Oh no, small child. Oh no, large woman. Oh no, mysterious person in the stone mask. Thank you, Miriam. You know who I am. And that means you know this face. I'm sorry we couldn't get here sooner, Dominique. So this is our contact. Yes, the church sent me. As you can see, I know a thing or two about expelling demons. An exorcist. And we're lucky to have you, Dominique. And the church you, Miriam. Thank you for guiding her here, Johannes. You wouldn't have asked if it wasn't important. But you should tell us why you need her. 
Miriam isn't one to shy away from danger, but she deserves to be armed with all the facts. Yes, very well. I told you when I contacted you that the Shardbinder Jebel is responsible for summoning the castle. Yes, there's no mistake about that. He admitted as much. What? You spoke to him? Then let me get right to the point. I find it curious that the outpouring of demons, facilitated by one Shardbinder, just happens to coincide with the sudden awakening of the other Shardbinder, after exactly ten years. You're right, it is strange. But the Church doesn't get to drag Miriam into this just because the timing is odd. Oh, do you decide for her then? I asked you to bring her here so she could see the horrors that have befallen the village and make an informed choice. I have no intention of forcing you, Miriam. You don't have to. I gave Jeebel my word that I would stop him. What happened here only strengthens my resolve. Thank you, Miriam. I am sorry to put it on your shoulders. Um, pardon me? We haven't forgotten you, small child. Oh, hello there. Are you alright? Yes, there is a... To ignore you? There is a setting that does enable or disable accessories during cutscenes. I just forgot it existed, so... Sorry for this cutscene to have Miriam wear the stone mask. I'm alright, thank you. You are quite welcome. Do you have a name? Anne. What a lovely name. Anne, you shouldn't be out here. Let me take you somewhere safe. Yes, go with the nun lady. Oh, alright. Come on, this way. Options. Other. Uh, oh yeah, we can change the others. Yes, we can have red, black, blue, green, purple, white, pink, magenta, lavender, sky blue, yellow, orange, and red blood. Uh, did I? I guess... Equipment... I guess it there isn't. Interesting. Oh well. Until we find a better uh, equipment, the mask stays on. Now, let me go to the chest! I did some looking around before, and this place seems secure. Yes, agreed. Johannes, you, Anne, and I will remain here. We can assist Miriam from safe ground. Welcome to Hubtown. What? We can't ask her to brave the castle alone? Yes, we can. Don't be foolish. She is trained in combat. Are you? Kind of. We would only get in the way. He could just make bombs. But that's not the point. I'll be fine, Johannes. Please don't worry. <sighs> All right. But we'll be here if you need us. Let's not waste any time. We have a lot to do. Come back if you need anything. I'll get a workshop running so I can perform alchemy for you. Craft aid. Thank you, Johannes. I know you're strong, but be careful. Small child. <laughs> I will. Waystone. Inventory. Waste it. Oh, yeah, let's take a look at things. Galleon map. Potato seed. Rice. Melting bone. Halite. Salt. Iron. Bruins. Sea urchin. A relic that takes you wherever you picture. Miriam, 
Welcome, welcome. Since this is your first time here, let me tell you a little bit about the supply post. Uh, please. I have made arrangements so you can buy and sell items here. I would have liked to provide what you need for free, but seeing as we are largely cut off from the church's funds out here, I will need money in order to keep the supply post stocked. I hope you don't mind paying. Well, given the fact that just about every uh, purple lantern drops stuff, yeah, no, I'm pretty sure I'm good. No, I understand. I appreciate you doing what you can. I can also buy shards from you if you no longer need them. No, we have a need of those. Wait, is trade in demon shards even allowed? Of course. The church would sooner gather them up and make certain they are purified. I am not permitted to sell them, but I can buy them off you. You may want to keep extras, since possessing multiple shards of the same type amplifies its power, but there is a limit to how far that can go. Okay. And more importantly, if you carry a large number of shards, your body's corruption may accelerate. But I'll find a way to deal with that myself. I still recommend selling your shards as a means of making money. Sure, yeah, about that. Alright, I know you're looking out for me. I think that explains everything. Now, would you like to have a look around? Purchase. What are you looking to buy? The Shabis! Garbo hat. Kung Fu. Combat. Lethal boots. 8 bit, 16 bit. Don't know what these do. As you can tell, there's going to be crafting. A lot of crafting. Thick glass. What are you looking to sell? I am not going to. S I forgot to give this to you. It's the key to the building. You can use it to explore further in. Thank you. I invited the other survivors inside where it's safe. They all have troubles that need resolving. If you can spare them the time, I'll do what I can. I know you will. Come back any time. I'll be praying for you. So there are still demons outside? Oh, they're so scary. Sit in chair. Dominique, what is all this machinery? That is photographic equipment we've been working on. Photographic? To put it more plainly, it allows me to capture images of real life, landscapes, people. What? Really? Uh, can I try it? Unfortunately, I don't have the silver bromide I need. I'll see if I can find it. Be right back. Side quest gotten. Here she is. You have to marvel at the church's resources. Look at what they've provided for us. I know. It's incredible. So, what I can do for you here in the workshop is take materials you bring me and transmute them into new items. Crafting! But the alchemy is easier to show you than explain. Here, I have some materials we can use. So let's try transmuting them. Webbing bone iron so, bronze. what'll it be? Craft. Potion. I'll go with this. There, all done. Better knife.
You know what? Fuck it. No dodgy time. You know what? Pirate hat. I'll go with this. Ooh, I like it. Toy shoes. Base Lord EP. I need obsidian for that one. The invisible blade. Lots of these things. And trust me, some of these are like, wait, why have you seen them early? And no, it's not because of the fact that I'm a backer in this game. It's because, quite literally, this is just how the game is. The, some of these are for, like, you need the 8-bit coin to create. Other ones are like, oh, hey, rounds, you need gunpowder. The ambivalence. Renee's gun. Bunny ears. Bat wings. Bunny scarf. He, yes, we can also do cooking in this one. Goodbye, Tunic. Oh, no. Goodbye, Country Trust. Once I've transmuted an item, I'll pass it on to Dominique so she can carry it at the supply post for you. This looks outrageous. I'll do my best to inform you of what items you can make from what materials. But when it comes to items I don't know about, you'll have to find a formula for me and bring it here. I understand. Also, the demon crystal you've obtained, the shards, those can be transmuted the same way as items. Each shard requires specific materials, but it's worth it to make your shards more useful. Try it when you get the chance. I think I will. Also, neither one of us has been eating well. No wonder, considering the struggle we've been through to survive. If you bring me the ingredients, I can use alchemy to prepare meals for us. With proper nutrition and a varied diet, you have the potential to get much stronger. Fun fact! Eat much, eat often. It's good to see you. What are we transmuting this time? So, but yes. I'll go with this. I'll go with this. I'll go with this. We need steel for the next one. Gunpowder. Johannes, can you tell me more about what happened ten years ago? It started when the interests of the rich shifted away from the spiritual and esoteric in favor of more material investments. Like this stone mask here. The alchemist's research was expensive. The guild members didn't want to lose their wealthy patrons, so they warned again and again that demons would come if people let go of their spirituality. But people don't change that easily. So the alchemists took a more drastic measure. They summoned Pokemon. I mean, demons. You mean us. The Shardbinders. Yes. It shames me that I was even connected to what they did. But at least you have the facts of it. It's all right. Thank you for telling me. And obviously the next room over is our couch. <sighs> It's only been an hour, so let's let's move on. Yeah, equipment. Uh... 
Hello. You there? It was awful. Those monsters came out of nowhere. We ran for dear life. Okay, Karen. Where are the others? Dead, most of them. My dear husband included. <sighs> Those devils have to pay. Those murderers. You look strong, miss. I'm begging you. Help me. If it's within my power. Oh, thank you. My name's Lindsay. What's yours? Miriam. Well, Miriam, I'll gather whatever information I can about the monsters that wronged us. I want you to hunt down the monsters and take vengeance on them. The efforts won't go unrewarded, I promise you that. All right. I'll do it. Here's what I've turned up on the monsters. Avenge her husband! Help my husband rest in peace. Kill that murderer dead! Got any targets for? Here's what I've turned up on the monsters. Best thing to do for these is just collect them and you'll deal with them throughout the the run. Yeah. Target. Eagle. Get the sword whip if we beat him. Help Julius the Chandler rest in peace. Kill those murderers dead. We helped to kill Ega. I think there's a problem with killing Ega. Haha! Melting skull. Capacity for bullets. This room looks interesting. I can't do anything in it. Not you. Bat. <laughs> okay, nope. I have to go up. This looks like a porkus. And we have a chair. Oh, hey, look, base lard. Oh, gee, what do we got here? Surprise gift! Base lard. Main gauche, Kar Karnwenen, and Mandau Pasir. Thank. Remember, you have to do it first. I know. Throw the weapon! That's a lot of birds. Go away, birds.
Okay. Ow. Jerk. The only way forward is through the castle. The entrance. And I'm pretty sure some of these pictures are kickstart backers. Oh no! Summon Bat! And yeah, as as you can tell, some of them kind of went whole hog. Double jump again. Ow, fuck you, puppy. Oh boy. Oh no. Get her moved. Can I get my heal spell? Hmm, bloody. Defending my actions to you. 
Wait, is that the narrator from Darkest Dungeon? Maybe. Don't I deserve it? You were like a father to me. Well, enough, child. I am here for the book. Jibo has the book. The book? Trinkets and baubles. What are you talking about? If you don't already know, then let us keep it that way. <sighs> Alfred, how are you still alive? Oh, what were you thinking of coming here? You can answer my question first. All that matters is that I am alive. Did you come here for the book? Or are you here for trinkets and baubles? Book? The Liber Logiath? Make no mistake. I won't let anyone touch that tome but me. Not even you should touch it. Didn't what happened ten years ago teach you anything? I don't have time to argue with you. I just hope you are wise enough not to get in my way. What? You know full well my power exceeds yours. Take Miriam and leave this place. Otherwise, you will die. Fuck off. I came here because something didn't feel right. But I didn't expect him. Johannes, what is the Liebe Logaiath? It's... It's a book the Alchemy Guild once possessed that allows for the summoning of spirits. The guild used it to bring about the calamity ten years ago. And the Shardbinder's crystal acted as a kind of catalyst. A book like that shouldn't even exist. I know. Alfred must be trying to restore the Alchemy Guild to power. But we cannot let him lay hands on the Liber Logaiath. He said Chibo had it. You know, I think I might have seen it. I told you that book was problematic. And it wasn't Giebel. Jeebel, Gumble, Gumby. It makes sense, considering the situation we're in. He must have gotten his hands on it after surviving the sacrifice. So now I have to stop Alfred, too. No, let's focus on Jeebel. If we can get to him and the book before Alfred does, we kill two birds with one stone. Good point. All right. Dominique might know what to do about Alfred in the meantime. I'll head back to the village and see what she has to say. Okay. Got another stone mask! Oh, thank God for couch. Oh, hey, books. 19, uh, 1764. This Attempting to create a my own monkey dress, I discovered a strange formula of a white crystal droid on the subject. What is it? A sign? At long last that my studies are progressing? Must observe it diligently while all, uh, while all I can. The crystal I discovered appears to be growing, uh, multiplying, slowly as corruption spreads through the cadaver I chose as the subject. It's marvelous substance, neither entirely liquid nor a solid. As soon as I have enough, I shall begin experiments to discover its other properties. Yep, yeah, can't do that one yet. Oh, 
No. Piclus. Birdish. Well, I guess we won't be able to do those because I don't have either of those. It only goes backwards, so. Well, yes. Oh, hey, steel. Hmm, red door. Wonder Loading. What... Garden of Silence! Loco weed. Gonna poke the weed! Death to the pig! Ow. Poke you. Haha. Haha. I have defeated Weed! Hello, sir? Fancy a ride. Why? Are you offering one? <laughs> I could take you someplace most interesting. The rub, of course, is that obstacle standing squarely on our path. See? <sighs> I doubt I would be able to push it aside. A shame you don't have a giant hand. Ah, the wild and crazy thing one could do with a giant hand. Really? That's a very specific and oddly uh, odd thing to say, Mr. Coachman. I guess I need a giant hand. Oh no, frog boys! I have exploded pork. Horses key.
Ow. Oh no! That's garbage. That's me. <sighs> Already read that one. Can't do that yet for reasons. Fuck you. Sirens. Okay. Plume Parma. Summon pig. Summon pig. Get pork.
Okay. <laughs> I'm going to try and get better. Uh, I mean, technically, Miriam's traditional weapon is actually hand to hand combat. Well, outside of, you know, Yeah. And we get the shard again! Guess I'm not going that way. <laughs> Go speak to our chariot, man. Thanks. If I only had a big hand.
Morgan's turn. I think that's a. It's a mace. Okay, up. Several months have passed since I wandered into the castle. I've managed to survive so far by rummaging through treasure chests without the monsters taking notice. I find something powerful today? For once, I'd like to crack open a chest and find some about one hunk of meat. Mmm. Yeah, that's a thing. Oh no! I got one of the plant boys. Fly trap! HP max up! Oh, thank god. I got True Arrow. Oh, no. Ah, wrong one. Alright. Uh don't have any manipulative, don't have any passive, don't have familiars. I feel like uh True Arrow would probably be a good one. This way. That looks Okay, what move did I just do? <coughs> I guess it doesn't tell you. Maybe Power Slash? Let me try it again. Let's see what this one says. Orbital Wheel! Lance Gate Assail. Uh, Circle. <laughs> yeah. So. Ah, there we go. I think it is. Oh, hey, look! We found. Teleport! Melting down. Well, let's go, I think, report to... Have you learned anything new? Here's what I've turned up on the monsters. Good work. Here's your reward. Three rings! That That's actually kind of funny that it's like... Paused! Wait, when did we get elf ears? I think I'll take that int. No, thumb mask. Are you eating properly? What are we transmuting this time? Stone thaw. Flesh.
think we should make the chemise, because that's mm -hmm. technically better. I'll go with this. Ooh, I like it. Oh, we need alkahests. Okay. There, I'll go with this. I'll go with this. Ah, yes, we need more pork. Anything that we can really make, make. Oh, the safe ring. There's attack power to increase defense. Eh. Mm, iffy. Picolus. Pelicus. Oh, about the castle. It may not be much help, but let me tell you what I know. The castle itself was summoned from hell, demons and all. But the site it rests on is where the Alchemist's Guild once lay. So you may find traces of our facilities intermingled with the rest. Interesting. Now that you mention it, I do remember seeing an area dedicated to the study of Eastern mysticism. Yes, and another of us was researching how to create giant organisms. Giant organisms. A giant hand, you say? Anyway, just be mindful of the facility's existence. The knowledge may keep you out of harm's way while you explore. All right. Thank you. Old lady? I'd rather kill over and die than spend another moment in a living hell like this one. Oh, don't say that. Never you mind me, young lady. What's your name? I'm Susie. Miriam. Is there anything I can do to help? Well... Uh, I do enjoy a good meal. But I can't remember the names of the dishes I like. I'll help you figure it out. I promise. Portable snack. Yes. I suppose I'll stick around and wait a little while longer. Oh, that's the one that we need to make, which is rice balls. I have something new to offer you. What Perch. are you looking to buy? Buy gunpowder. Flamborge. Yeah, let's see, Garbo hat is slightly better at that. Take our nice big couch. Oh, 
Are you eating prop? So, what'll it be? So we need rice. So we need two pieces of rice. Pizza. I like how eggs... I like how scrambled eggs is... Mo it requires more things than just a rolled omelette. Wait. Dragon egg! Oh hey, mac and cheese. White sauce. I think we get those from ghosts. Morgenstern. I actually have that. Tsurumaru. Alfred was your master, wasn't he? Former master. Why? I don't know. I was just wondering if you remember anything about him that I don't. Fair enough. As I recall, he was studying ways of drastically slowing down objects. Slowing down objects, you say? He was a genius, to be quite honest. But I have no respect for that now. Why not? Because he fought against sacrificing you right to the final moment. Only to change his mind like a coward. I see. Thank you. Got any t Here's what I've turned up on the monsters. Well, we get more. Avenge the death of Rosalie. Dull hammer, that's... Help my little sister kill those mad... Have... Here's what I've turned up on the monsters. Get a wound? My cup kill those. Mo Have here's what I've turned up on the monsters. Sebnock. Help my neighbor kill those. Mo Got any tough? Here's what I've turned up on the monsters. Wait, aren't all these names like, uh, Castlevania names? Like Rosalie, Annette, Lisa, Julius, Diamond. Simon. <laughs> I mean, that's the obvious one. You know. Yeah. Help Doctor Simon rest in peace. Kill those murderers dead. Okay, let's see here. Archives, demons. Morta. Go. Yeah. Look. See, Morta doesn't have a shard. Whereas, like, Ghost, Giant Rat, Blood Grinder Knight... Oh, it, okay. Well, I guess I was wrong. Yeah. Oh, that's a sap knock. Okay. Can't remember this all that. The Bone Morta has one. Della Hammer. Yes, yes, that is actually his head, apparently. Hello. Hey, 
Monka weed. Plume Parma. Look at this piggy. Uh, let's. Hello. I'm glad me fields are rid of those monsters. But they're in a terrible state. I need to replant everything. What will you grow? Well, I haven't decided yet. <laughs> Where are my manners? I'm Harry. Miriam. Tell me, Miriam, do you have anything I might be able to grow? Because if you let me do the farming, I'll give you your share of the harvest, and you won't even have to lift a finger. Oh, all right. I'll keep an eye out. Good. I'll be waiting in the fields. Let's do rice seed. Can you plant this? Sure. I'll get to work. What a bloodbath. We were slaughtered. But you're not like us. You're strong. I saw you fighting. Oh, it was more luck than skill. Oh, humble, too. My name is Abigail. What's yours? Miriam. Well, Miriam, might I ask you a favor? I want to give the dead a proper burial. Of course. But, but that's not going to be possible for some. In the very least, though, I'd like to bury some keepsake for each of them. A Valkyrie like you should have no trouble finding such things. Can I count on you? I'll see that you're rewarded. I'd be happy to do it. Thank you. Then, let me show you. In memory of Catherine, yes. Thank you. How are you? Here's what you asked for. This is it. That's one more villager we can lay to rest. Here's your reward. Apparently that villager was not wearing a tunic. Ooh, we got the rice. This is the keepsake I'm looking for. Right. I'll see if I can find it. Caleb, ring. Thank How are you? Got three of these things. Here's what you asked for. This is it. That's one more villager we can lay to rest. Here's your reward. I'm going to be finishing up after this. Probably. This keeps... Right. So, Caleb, Catherine, Noel. Okay. Pizza! Thank. Okay. Well, in that case, let's make some rice balls. One for our protagonist and one for our old lady. Are you eat so what'll it be? I'll go with this. Great. Johannes, how was it you figured out a way to stop the crystal from corrupting me? I hate to say it, but I borrowed a bit from Alfred's research. He was studying ways to slow down objects. My attempts only worked when I placed Enochian script equivalent to what he chose in the same circular pattern. Uh, I think I understand. Sort of. <laughs> Do you now? I understand that you're far smarter than me. And a poor teacher, apparently. Alright, let's give the old woman her, uh, rice ball. And go from there. Did you... Rice ball. That's it. How did you know? Oh, oh, I can't wait to try it. Oh, it's delicious. Uh, save some for me. I feel a little better. Thank you, miss. You're welcome. Don't give up. You're going to get through this. Got the thorn whip. And I'm pretty sure that's a permanent bonus, by the way. Is there anything else you'd mm -hmm. like to eat? 
Yes, actually. But hang it all, I, I can't remember what it's called. I'll help you figure it out. Something irresistible. It's round and top of something gooey and stretchy. I wonder what that could be. I suppose I'll stick around and wait a little Oh, especially while when you longer. get an icon. Yeah, it's pizza. But I will save some of this for off stream, like the gr uh, the killing of enemies. But well, when you're grinding or something. <laughs> yeah, when I'm grinding. But uh, that's actively uh, uh, about it, actually. So. Well, you didn't get re get to the second boss, unfortunately. Nope. I didn't get to the second boss. But then again, that's kind of the thing, is that I know where the next boss is. We were right next to the room, but I was, like, not very sure if we wanted to continue at that point. Yeah, because it's a question of how many <laughs> minutes slash hours would it be. How many attempts it would be. Which, that can be... <sighs> so, I'm not going to be... Uh, trying too hard on that one. But, uh, yeah, no. I, I'm liking to do a bit more of Bloodstain because, hey, it's, it's different. Yes, I know it's going to be just me dying again and again and again to the boss, but then again, when has that not stopped me? I mean, that was the case in Deedlet's Wonder Labyrinth. Um, I mean, that, hey, because trust me, the, the, those bosses, those later bosses, while fun, oh boy, <laughs> just trying to get the patterns down, but, uh, next Tuesday, we may change things up for Tuesday and Thursday stream, uh, mostly because of the fact that we are kind of hitting a, kind of a major I wouldn't say blockage, but definitely a just the point in satisfactory. Uh, we may, I'm not sure what Eddie has picked to do because it could be uh, lies of P, which that seems to be the heavy case. But he may change it up at the last minute. I'm not too sure. Uh, there was a podcast that was released today. Uh, it was the five-year retrospective about the previous Game, game Aw Awards. Game Awards, which was... 2018, I believe. That's weird Be Okay, yeah. Since it was 2023. Um, it was interesting seeing some of the things like... The fact that uh, The Messenger won... Uh, Best, best debut indie game? Best debut indie game. Uh, from Sabotage Studios, a.k.a. the people behind Sea of Stars. And it's also the fun factor that, like, people are like, oh yeah, you need to play Messenger, because it's a interesting take on the Metroidvania from their perspective. More on the Vania side of Metroid. Because, like, it seems to be just, like, you know more in tune to, like, uh, Bloodstain's two, uh, 2D, uh, like, old, uh, NES-style games that I think we played one and beat it in two streams. I didn't get the best ending, but that's because it's like, you need to have all the characters live and beat the appropriate bosses with the appropriate, uh, appropriate characters. Uh... But, there's a podcast about it, we go through the all of the major entrants, except for, like, eSports, but that's because it's fucking eSports. Uh, that, uh, the podcasts are on all major platforms, so that's Google, Apple, Spotify. As for these streams, all of our streams are archived on our YouTube channel. Uh, so you can play catch-up, or if you missed out on most of the stream, don't be afraid, it's right there. 
on that, uh, best way to help us is, of course, just, uh, probably just spread the word. Let other people know about us. Uh, outside of that, we do have a Patreon that you can follow or the subscribe points here on Twitch. But, uh, thanks everybody for joining and we will see you Tuesday or Thursday or Friday. Bye, everybody!